Hello everyone and welcome back. Um, so, I've been working on a few things. I uh, haven't really got a chance to do many videos. We're just trying to build this game at the moment. So we've got a new new sword or an axe. Uh, that looks pretty great. And now uh, we did a few more changes to our effect and got it to work with our weapon. Uh, so that's really good. So just pressing E and uh, there's the effects. And it damages players. Oh, damage the dummy. That's pretty good. So at the moment, I've just set it uh, so I can keep pressing it. But there, obviously, there'll be a delay uh, once I set that. So probably about three seconds or something. I was gonna try and I found this thing just on the free items and I modified it a bit uh, it's like a it's pretty bright actually maybe not that bright but I was gonna throw that out from from the axe maybe that can be one of the other attacks like some kind of ice um, ice shard type thing um, rather than just that bar but I'm sure we can hook that up it's just a model so it's a little bit difficult I've got to use a different bit of code to um, get that to work yeah so um, I think the next steps for our game is we need to um, instead of having this uh, equip weapon here uh, we're probably gonna have just some buttons where we can click say Q and, and E and and things like that so uh, that's where we're up to. So this will work quite well. Actually, it looks looks good with our swing. So the animation we worked on uh, on the on the previous video, where our uh, sw swinging the axe, uh, that's working with this effect. Uh, so it's really good to see all that come together. Um, and we'll probably do a fireball soon. It's similar to this actually. If uh, throws it out, uh, so we'll set that to go to 40, about 40. Uh, squares it goes so oh, it's not too bad anyway I just want to show you that um, I probably could show you a bit of code uh, what else is new um, you spawn in with the weapon uh, and yeah let's just try that then so we'll just clean this up We've got a, a different animation for our. I've got to close all these doors. Yeah, we've got a different animation for our idle. So um, we set that to um, be attached to the player once they spawn in. And they automatically get equipped with this weapon. So eventually, obviously, when they pick up items in the game then we can just change uh, the weapon that they get equipped with with uh, whatever the item is that they previously had equipped uh, so uh, yes yeah, so I'll just spawn back in probably yeah, four players will do I'll just spawn back in and show you the um, the idle animation and Yeah, see, normally when you. I'm going to wait for these screens to come up. I'm testing with four players. Yeah, normally when you. If you don't add an animation to your character, the character just stands there with his arm down or sort of pointing it straight up. So I've, I've got him so he moves his arm a little bit so the axe is kind of behind his head um, and it works quite well so that's it for this video so uh, in the next few days obviously having a bit of a break over Easter so I haven't had much chance to do many videos so the next hopefully this week I'll get to be able to do a video on the code related to this so a lot's coming up and we'll do a few new spells like fireballs and um, get some icons down the bottom here. So we've got our damage working. 
Uh, I do have a damage meter out here as well um, that I just need to s sort of fix up. Uh, yeah, you can see it's uh, showing you the number and it go goes away so that's something we'll add as well uh, to the mobs. Yeah and that's it for this video so uh, hope to be back again tomorrow. All the best. Thank you.